Andy Gardner is the epitome of leadership and he took the leadership on the issue of uh, children with unique abilities and advocated for them and passed legislation, the Gardner Act. Uh, so he's uh, done a, a, a tremendous amount of, of work, good work for children. Andy Gardner is one of those leaders that really empowers his team. Diversity and inclusion has always been a very important part of Orlando Health's culture, and I feel like Andy is really the driver of that. He's a man of faith, he's a man of integrity, um, he's very principled, he knows what he believes in, and kind of lives his life according to those principles. I think across the board when it comes to adult with unique abilities, he's really been a, a really a very strong advocate. Andy is a servant leader, and I've always been impressed watching him, um, I think because of his collaborations and his partnerships and his relationships in this community. He's really one of those um, leaders that kind of works the underground, and then all of a sudden, things just happen and appear. The Florida Unique Abilities Partnership he's worked on, looking for the job creation opportunities for people, people with unique abilities, and it was also focused a great deal on the children. Andy's a great dad, I think that helps when he's making decisions or comes across situations, I think he always thinks about how they would impact, impact not just our children, but that helps him to think about how it would impact children all across Florida. I think what Andy's experience within his own family gave him a new perspective of what it's like um, for those with unique abilities. Having Andrew in our lives, we were always very compassionate towards other people, but having Andrew has given us the opportunity to see firsthand how parents who have children with unique abilities do their best every day to provide resources and opportunities for their children to provide the best life that they possibly can. I'm always struck by his humility and how he gives credit to everyone else, whether it's our team or it's someone else in the community, or he gives credit to the nonprofits like Center for Independent Living that's doing such incredible work. Every day he was always aware of and thinking about what he could do to make a difference in the lives of people with unique abilities. With his leadership, particularly in the legislature, uh, that really establishes the kind of legacy that Beverly would be very proud of. He is the perfect person to represent this award.